I'm not going to twist people's arms. Let me just put it out there. Here's what we got to do. You double NASA's budget. I don't want to be driven by one destination or another. I don't want to say, our next thing we're going to do in space, we're going to go to Mars. Excuse me, how about all the rest of space? Let's create a suite of launch vehicles. One configuration will get you to the moon. Another will get you to Mars. Maybe there's an asteroid headed our way. We want to do something about that. We got another special configuration of rockets that'll get us there. And I'm not going to discriminate. If there's a tourist reason to go to the backside of the moon, we got the launch vehicles to do it. You want to mine the moon? That's another configuration. Scientists want to study, see if there's life on Mars? We'll do that too. I can guarantee you every week there's going to be a new headline. Some new invention is going to be granted. Some new patent is going to be offered. Because space is hard, space is dangerous, space is exciting. These innovations make headlines, and those headlines work their way down the educational pipeline. And everybody in school knows about it. You don't have to set up a program to convince people that being an engineer is cool. You do that, it'll jumpstart our dreams. That's what it'll do.